Hello everyone, I welcome you all for Sindhya's weekly book review. Today we are going to see about the book Leaders Eat Last by Simon Sinek. My favorite author Simon Sinek, he is also a coach, uh, leadership expert and so on. The book explores the leadership qualities and how organization affect the leadership style. Simon Sinek presents a lot of uh, information about leadership and the teamwork. Now we are going to see a few important takeaways about leadership and the teamwork. Simon Sinek is talking about importance of creating a safe and trust environment. If people trust, they'll work more. If leaders create a very good safe and trust environment obviously the people the worker the subordinate the team members feel so safe and they put their full effort at the work they are more likely to take risk they are ready to collaborate with other people and they usually give their complete work their best at their work the next key takeaway is leaders should serve the teams Yes, people should, the leader should help the team members. The leader should give their guidance. The leader should give the support to the team members. They should give the resources to the team. This create a sense of loyalty and the commitment among the team members. The next key area is building relationship and fostering connections. So what is important for the strong team a very good connection yes if everybody is connected with each other in a very positive way then people will feel very uh, safe feel pleasure and they'll work more the leader should encourage the open communication active listening transparency between the people and genuine connections among the team members so automatically the connections the strong connection built between the people and that good relation makes us the team uh, work better the important one simon sinek is talking about is the care and the empathy the real leader who is always thinking about his or her team members work atmosphere who always care about their team members by understanding and empathizing their the employees uh, real challenges and the problems uh, leaders can address their issues by helping them by supporting them the next thing is the danger of the toxic leadership simon sinek explores about the negative leadership who always think about his own interest who creates the hostile environment and also unethical behavior this toxic leadership damages the team's performance it also spoils the trust and team performance identifying and addressing this toxic leadership is really really crucial in every organization the next important key area is clear vision and clear purpose the leader who has a clear vision and has purpose only inspire and motivate their team members their subordinate and their organization people the team members who understand the why the question why why they are doing the work that why is really really important so who understand the why they can deliver the goal easily the next the role of the leadership in fostering innovations the leader who should encourage the people to take risk they should encourage the people to learn from the failure it is okay to try and get failure facing failure is not a problem but they should teach the people to try something different then only that innovation that innovative ideas will come by creating the culture of innovation and continuous improvement the organization automatically will grow 
the next key area is value creating by leading an example leaders should create a value and set examples for their team members the leader who demonstrate their integrity humility accountability responsibility that leader inspire and influence the people by doing so they set an example for their team members overall leaders eat last the book emphasize the importance of leadership in the organization read the book to get the complete knowledge about the book leaders eat last by simon sinek thanks for watching subscribe like and share to get more weekly book review